let's start the proof of integration that is given from 0 to a fx dx and we can write it as equal to 0 to a f of a minus of x dx so i will take this part first i'm writing the value of rhs that is given as equal to 0 to a f of a minus of x dx so we will take the value of a minus of x that is equal to t now we will differentiate on both sides i will write this one as equal to minus of dx and you will get the value as dt now we will put the interval for putting the interval we will put the value of x that is equal to a you will get the value of t that is equal to zero once you put the value of x is equal to zero you will get the value of t that is equal to a so we can write the same thing in the form of a till 0 f of t and this dx can be written as minus of dt so we will get this value as equal to a to 0 minus here i am writing and you will get f of t t now if i will change the uh, interval that is given from 0 to a and you will write the same thing as a to 0 so you will write this one from 0 to a f of t dt so the whole value of negative will become positive now there's a concept that we are having if i am having the function which is having the operator as fx or t but the interval is same you will get the same integral value so we will write the same thing as equal to 0 to a f of x dx and that's how you will prove the value of f of x dx that is going from a 0 to a we can write the same thing as 0 to a f of a minus x similarly we can also prove the value that is given from a to b f of x dx that is having the integration a to b f of a plus b minus of x dx so what we'll do here we will take the value of a plus b minus of x that is equal to p now we will differentiate it on both sides you will write this value as equal to minus of dx and here you will write this one as equal to dt now we will put the value of x that is equal to a because here we are having the interval that is given as a and then we will put the value of x that is equal to b for that you are getting the value of t that is given as a plus b minus of a and here you will get the value of t that is given as a plus b minus of so b and b will get cancelled a and a will get cancelled you will get here the value of b and here you will get the value of t that is equal to a now what we will do here we will write the value as equal to given the value as ft and this one can be written as minus of t and here if you can put the interval instead of a i will put the interval of t that is going from b to now if i will change the interval from a to b to b to a you will write the value as equal to b to a and this value will become positive ft t. as i already told you the function that is given whatever the operator that you are taking for the function if the interval is same you will take this value as equal to a to b f of x so you are having the same property in both of these things but initial one we are having from 0 to a but in this one we are taking the value from a to both the conditions that you can take and you can apply these concept in most of the questions of integration that is coming in iit as frequently so you will use these concepts and solve the question as much as you can thank you